In this video, I explain constructions and working of sequence valve. So if you know the meaning of sequence, then you can easily understand the working and functions of the sequence valve. Sequence valve is used to perform two operations in sequence, one after the other. For example, the sequence valve is used in a such a system in which more than one actuators is used in a hydraulic or a pneumatic system. Okay. So suppose we consider it is a two cylinder is used in any hydraulic or a pneumatic system. Okay. So for example, first cylinder will be extend and after that, after that means the in a first cylinder the extension is over and the, after that means extension is completed in cylinder one. Then after cylinder two will be extend. It is called as the sequence means the cylinder is extends or a retract in a proper sequence. It is called as the sequence. Okay. So this is the functions of the sequence valve to operate the number of cylinder in a proper sequence. It has an existing screw, a spring and a conical poppet which are mounted inside the valve body as shown in the figure. Here you see image of sequence valves. Okay. In a sequence valve here you see this one component is the existing screw okay this is the spring and this is the conical poppet and the sequence valve have a one inlet and it have the two outlet okay means this is the one outlet here one is written here the two is written so this is a two outlet ports so number one outlet port is connected with the cylinder one and the number two outlet is connected with the cylinder two so it has one inlet port and two outlet ports outlet ports one and outlet ports 2 that I already explained this is outlet port 1, outlet port 2 and this is the inlet port. When working fluid is supplied to inlet port of a sequence wall, it flow directly to the outlet port 1 and the first cylinder is extends means in an inlet port the oil is supplied from a pump. Okay, So when the oil is entered in these inlet ports, from these inlet ports it is supplied to the outlet port 1 means from the outlet port 1 it is supplied to the cylinder 1 and cylinder 1 is the extent. By completion of this extension of the first cylinder pressure in the line is increased means suppose the in a cylinder 1 extension is complete then the cylinder 1 is not absorbed the more oils okay then oil is coming back and when the oil is coming back the pressure of the oil is increased here okay and when the pressure of the oil is increased here this conical poppet is moving in upper directions okay so pressure in the line is increased and, and hence the poppet of sequence valve is lift off from its seats and it's allow the working fluid to flow to the pot 2 hence the cylinder 2 is extends. So when the pressure is increased here this poppet is lifted off and the oil from the inlet pot is supplied to this pot 2 and from the pot 2 it is supplied to the cylinder 2 and cylinder 2 is start to extends. Okay here the fluid word is used because the, suppose it is a use in hydraulic systems or a, as well as it is also used in the pneumatic systems. The sequencing is achieved between the two cylinder means in a two cylinder the extension is carried out in a proper sequence. Sequence valve can allow working fluid in a reverse direction from the port 1 means during the retractions the oil is coming back from the cylinder to the inlet ports means here in a port 1. Okay. So, Sequence valve can allow working fluid in a reverse direction from the port 1 means from the port 1 the oil is coming reverse but it does not allow reverse flow from the port 2. Retraction of the first cylinder is possible but retraction of the second cylinder is not possible. I mean, suppose we use this simple sequence valve then the retraction in cylinder 1 is possible but cylinder 2 is not possible. Suppose means oil is coming back during the retraction stroke then what happen? The oil is come here and poppet is seat means the oil is not go back. Okay. For solving that we need to put the one check valves. So hence the check valve is essential for the reverse free flow of the working fluid from cylinder 2 to the tank for the retractions of second cylinders. So sequence valve with integral check valve as shown in this figure. So here you see this one image. Okay. In this one image in between this outlet port 1 and outlet port 2 1 check valve is provided means when the retraction in a cylinder 2 is going on at that time the oil is coming in this 2 pot and from the 2 pot it is supplied to the pot 1 and from the pot 1 it is go back to the tank or a reservoirs.
So thank you for watching this video. If you learned something, then like the video and subscribe my channels for watching the more video related to the OHP as well as other subject of the mechanical engineering. For the OHP, the link is provided in descriptions as well as in a card. Card mean on a top right screen of your mobiles or laptop. You see this I symbol for other subject. I request to visit the playlist of my channel.